You're freaking me out. Well, come on, give me audience participation now. Well, here's a little story that I got to tell about a girl named Zan that you're gonna know well. It's starting right here at the Ice House tonight. Just me, some strangers, and a little stage fright. We got some new jokes that never been told. My friend says they're crazy, but I say I'm bold. Okay, I'm done with this rhyme. I get this got this far. Follow me on Facebook because I'm gonna be a star. Yeah, it's me talking and everything. That's hard to think that fast. Never do that again. You guys are rough. The alternate ending in my head was, uh, after this I need to ride home because I don't have a car. <laughs> Which is sad but true. I know. How's that though for starting out rapping, white girl on stage rapping? Edgy for 1986. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I'm a, I'm like wiffle ball, man. Imagine you like a strawberry shortcake nightmare coming at you. Oh yeah. Imagine you like a Care Bear on crack. I'm gonna hug you to death. <laughs> it's sad that I don't have a card too. I get a ride here from a friend of mine, and um, you know it's. <sighs> It's tough when you don't have a car and you're trying to date, because like if a guy's like, Zan, I'd like to meet you later at the club. I gotta be like, okay, let me check my schedule. See what time do the buses run. <laughs> it's not very attractive. I have a hard time dating because I'm, I get defensive really easy in this. Like for example, this one guy goes, hey Zan, I'd like to see what you look like with long hair and a short skirt. I was like, yeah, well, I'd like to see what you look like with two less kids and a job. <laughs> I'm kidding, I didn't really say that. Because <laughs> he never called back. <laughs> no, but he, he did turn me down on Facebook. Because I can pick him. <laughs> Yeah, he sent me a little message that said, I don't think we're going to have a second date. And, uh, and this, was, this was the pretty punch in the face. He goes, oh, because you're just intimidatingly smart. Aww. Aww, intimidating. Isn't that great? Now on the race to become my mother's officially on. <laughs> Thanks, intimidating. Well, I, I like to learn from my mistakes, though. And on that one, I learned that on a first date, I should never, ever say macrocosmic archetypal or fractal. <laughs> That's like a verbal burka. <laughs> Invisible. <laughs> However, I did learn that, whoops, hon, ouchie, my bra's too tight. That works. 